Okay, guys. Assalamu alaikum and welcome to the Accelerated English Course 1.1 for those who think that they need to listen to the pronunciation of the words so that they can um, يعني pronounce better. تمام هيدا الفيديو راح يكون مخصص للعالم يلي بدهم يسمعوا بشكل مكرر الكلمات لحتى يقدروا يلفظوهم بشكل صحيح. Okay, so let's start. Okay, we have here Algeria, Bahrain, Comoros, Djibouti, Egypt, Iraq, Jordan, Kuwait, Lebanon, Libya, Mauritania, Morocco, Oman, Palestine, Qatar, Saudi Arabia, Somalia, Sudan, Syria, Tunisia, United Arab Emirates, Yemen. Where are you from? What do we say? We say, oh, I am from, and then we say the country. I am from Yemen. I am from Iraq. I am from Egypt. I am from Jordan. I am from Kuwait. I am from Libya. I am from Algeria, I am from Morocco, I am from Lebanon, etc, etc. I am from Sudan, I am from Palestine, I am from Qatar, I am from Oman, etc, etc. Okay, that's it. And then we have the English alphabet. How do we have to pronounce it? Well, we have A, B, C, D. A, B, C, D, E, F, G. H I J K L M N O P Q R S T U V W X Y and Z. So I will repeat A B C D E F G H I J K L M N O P Q R S T U, V, W, X, Y, and Z. How many letters do we have in alphabet? We have 26, okay? This is the answer. Now, the vowels versus the consonants. How many vowels do we have in English? We have five vowels. A, E, I, O, and U. And what do we mean by a vowel? A vowel is a letter that is pronounced with sound, okay? طالعه مع صوت. بينما consonants are all the others وبيطلعوا صامتين. كرمال هيك اسمون consonants. تمام؟ They are either pronounced with the lips or with the tongue. Now, when do we put an and what do we put a? We put an before letter, before... Uh, Words beginning with letter A, E, I, O, and U while pronouncing them, okay? Why? We put the consonants before the words starting with... Uh, we put A before the words starting with consonants such as, for example, A baby, A book, A paper, A towel, A window, A street, all these, we put with them A while we put an in front of the words beginning with vowels such as igloo, orange, etc, etc. For example, an igloo, an orange, an elephant. Okay, that's it. Now, how do we pronounce these words? We say ant, ball, cap, drum, eggplant, frog, globe, hot dog, ice cream, jellyfish. K, lizard, mushroom, nutria, onion, pupae, queen bee, rocket, snail, tank, umbrella, violet, watch, x-ray, yogurt, zipper. Arrow, apple, astronaut, anchor, alligator, ant, ball, bat, bee, banana, balloon, boat, cat, Car, carrot, cow, camel, cake, dog, dolphin, donkey, dress, door, duck.
empty, envelope, elephant, egg, eggplant, elk, frog, fish, fan, fire, flower, flag, grass, grasshopper, goat, goose, grapes, gorilla, house, hat, hippo, heart, horse, hammer. Igloo, iguana, invitation, insect, inkworm, inside, jellyfish, jar, jacket, jam, juice, jet, K, kiss, kick, koala, kangaroo, kite, lizard, lion, ladybug, lobster, leaf, legs. Map, moon, mountain, mouse, monkey, milk, nose, nail, nap, nest, nuts, ninja, octopus, olive, otter, on, ox, ostrich, pineapple, pig, panda, parrot, pencil, penguin. Quarter, quilt, queen, quail, question, quiet, rat, robot, reno, rain, rock, rabbit, sub, snail, sun, spider, snake, star, truck, tiger, turtle, tree, table, turkey. Under, uphill, umbrella, underwear, upstairs, underground, volcano, van, vacuum, violin, vest, vulture, wave, watermelon, wagon, worm, window, walk, box, wax, six, axe, fax, fox, yak, yacht, yard, yam, yoga, yogurt, zebra, zucchini, zipper, zero, zoo, zigzag. Now, when do we put A and when do we put an? We say a banana, an ice cream, a pear, an orange, an apple, a cake, an umbrella, an orange, a frog, a dog, a cat, an ice cream, a shoe, a goat, an umbrella, a bat, an elephant, a fish, an apple, a spider, a dog. It's a giraffe, it's a frog. It's an octopus, it's a snail, it's an elephant, it's a fish, it's an ostrich, it's a chick, it's an albatross, it's a star. Using a and the, we use a and an to say about indefinite words when the words are indefinite and then we say the when the words are definite. The usage of the is related to specific countable and uncountable nouns, such as the soap, the dog, the cats. And we said that we put it either in front of singular or plural words. We also put it in front of already mentioned words before the superlative, before the musical instruments, the guitar, the piano, before nationalities, the Greeks, the French, before family names, the Browns, the Clintons, before hotels, the Ritz, the Grand Britain, the Hilton, before cinemas, the Odeon, the Palace, before newspapers, such as the New York Times, the Guardian, the Guardian. Um, also, we have uh, before organizations such as, such as the Boy Scouts, the Red Cross, seas, rivers, oceans, deserts, mountain ranges, groups of islands, sub-countries, dates. We also put them before uh, the times in the day, in the morning, in the afternoon, in the evening, before unique people and things such as the sun, the moon, the rope, the president, etc., etc. Now, the numbers from 0 till 100, we have 0, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9. 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24, 25, 26, 27, 28, 29, 30, 31, 32, 33, 34, 35, 36, 37, 38, 39, 40, 41, 42, 43, 44, 45, 46, 47, 48, 49, 40, 50, 
The colors green, yellow, blue, orange, purple, red, gray, brown, maroon, olive, silver, pink, cyan, rust, gold, charcoal, magneta, bronze, cream, violet, navy blue, mustard, black, teal, tan, lavender, mauve, peach, coral, burgundy. Uh, what I need from you is the following. Green, yellow, blue, orange, purple, red, gray, brown, black, and white. That's it. And days of the week. Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, Saturday, Sunday. So here, if we want to do this exercise, what do we do? If today, it's Wednesday, so yesterday was Tuesday and the next day will be Thursday. So you have to do the following exercise. And here we have the ordinal numbers. And I want from the ordinal numbers just from 0 to 10. Because if you know the cardinal numbers, you will only need to put th in the in the end. So we have 0, 1st, 2nd, 3rd, 4th, 5th, 6th, 7th, 8th, 9th, and 10th. The months of the year. January, February, March, April, May, June, July, August, September, October, November, December. And then you have to do this, this exercise, which is you have to put when of these months are in winter, spring, summer, and autumn. Winter is Shita, spring is Rabia, summer is Saif, and autumn is Kharif. Okay, uh, months of the year, what are the months of the year? Here you have to do the, the exercise. You have the 12th month of the year, the sixth month of the year, etc., etc. You have to do the whole exercise. Here, you have to tell the date. How do we tell the date? We say March 7th. Okay, this is the first way. Or we say the 7th of March. Okay, so it's either that we put the day before the month or the month before the day. Amen? That's it. Now, the family, we have the grandfather and grandmother. Uh, we have uncle, aunt, father, mother. Then we have the sons and the daughters. We have the husband, the wife, يعني الزوج والزوجة, the daughter, niece, nephew, niece, nephew, يعني ولد الأخت ولد الخي, and that's it. The cousins هني ولد العم, the aunt and the uncle هي العم, the uncle هو العم أو الخال, and the aunt هي الخالة أو العمة. Okay, and that's it. They are so easy in English. The family. The grandson, granddaughter, هني الحفيد. Granddaughter هي الحفيدة الأنثى و grandson هو الحفيدة الذكر. And then we took the professions. We have accountant, actor, architect, astronomer, baker, bricklayer, bus driver, butcher, carpenter, chef, cleaner, dentist, designer, doctor, electrician, engineer, factory worker, farmer, fireman, florist, gardener, hairdresser, journalist, judge, lawyer. Lecturer, librarian, lifeguard, mechanic, model. What is your profession? You say, I am A, and, you, and then you put your profession. For example, I am a teacher. I am a translator. I am a journalist. I am a judge. I am a lawyer. I am a doctor. I am a dentist. That's it. Okay? Here also we have more professions. We have newsreader, nurse, optician, painter, pharmacist, photographer, pilot, plumber, politician, policeman, 
postman, real estate agent, receptionist, scientist, secretary, shop assistant, soldier, tailor, taxi driver, teacher, translator, traffic warden, travel agent, veterinary doctor, waiter, fisherman, dancer, businessman, artist, band bartenders. And then you say your profession. Now, here we have the personal pronouns. What are the personal pronouns? The personal pronouns are I, yani ana, you, yani anta, he, yani huwa, she, yani hiya, it, huwa huwa, lil jamid, aw al hayawan, we, yani nahnu, you, yani antum, they, yani hum. I will repeat. I, you, he, she, it, we, you, they. And then we have verb to be. What is the verb to be? هو فعل كان. بالعربي نحن منقول أنا دكتور أنا مدرس أنا ااا وبنحط من غير من وراها ال profession أو منقول أنا من لبنان أنا من سوريا أنا من الأردن إلى آخره. بالإنجليش ما فينا نعمل هيك. We have to put verb to be before the profession. I have to say I am. وبعدين بكف الجملة. Uh, I am a dentist. I am from Lebanon. I am from Jordan. I am a woman. I am a man. Okay? لازم عطول حط am لحتى دل على فعل كان لي هو فعل مساعد ليعمل لي جملة بسيطة. Okay? So, I am, you are, he is, she is, it is, we are, you are, they are. This is the verb to be, okay? And then we have a long exercise. You have to try to do it alone. If you don't know, I will be helping you in the next session. And you have to answer the following questions. It's either you have to answer them in the um, quiz sheet or in the YouTube commands. What are you going to do? You say your name. What is your name? You answer with a full answer. My name is, and then you say your name. My name is Sara. My name is Rola. My name is uh, Lamis. My name is Claudia, whatever. Or you say, I am, and then you put your name. For example, I am Muhammad. I am Isa. I am, uh, I don't know, Salim. Okay, that's it. Now, how old are you? It's the question to say your age. How old are you? I am 17 years old. I am 21 years old. I am 15 years old. I am 37 years old. Okay, so I am and years old. Come in, what is your profession? Okay, what do you say? I am an engineer. I am a teacher. I am a plumber. I am a translator, etc., etc. And the question that you know very well: Where are you from? Min aina antum? You say I am from and you. Dghre btulo al country. Yani I am from Jordan. I am from Lebanon. I am from Syria. I am from Iraq. I am from Morocco. Okay? It's as simple as that. As that. I hope you enjoyed the session. And see you the next one. Thank you so much for attending. And I want to see your answers in the comments. Okay? Thank you.